Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do another makeup look. Um, I'm thinking about using this beautiful palette here. Let's see what I come up with. Oh, well, first I'm going to start off with my eyebrows. So let's go ahead and do that. And I use the Anastasia. Um, so let's do this. I hope everything's good. I hope you guys are all good. Sorry, you guys, I'm just concentrating on my eyebrows. I'm not talking much. So I am so excited. The other day, I did somebody's makeup I am practicing her makeup for her quinceanera. She wants me to do her look. I was going to record it, but um, she was shy, so I didn't do it. So I was like, okay, that's fine. So I took a few pictures. I don't even want to post her because she's really shy. She don't want to be posted. So I'm going to respect that. But I'm excited because I want to do it for like a career. And I think it would be really cool to do that. I think I did it too dark, but it's okay. Sometimes I can get my eyebrows right, and sometimes I can't. So I want to start practicing more looks. To get better. So what do you guys think? Should I, I like try to practice looks for like quinceanera weddings or like i don't know baby shower like or any type of events i think it'd be cool to do it to do like makeup makeup looks for like weddings and stuff it has always been my passion to do like makeup and I, and I always have wanted to learn, too. Well, this eyebrow is definitely lighter than the other side. So, let's see if I can try to fix it. The way I like to do my eyebrows, I like to overdraw it a bit. And then I can clean it up with the concealer i hope i'm talking loud enough i hope this is not an epic fail you guys <laughs> and for all of the people that do like that are like makeup artists you guys have any like tips and tricks and how to get comfortable with doing somebody's makeup it would it would be very much appreciated because that's something that i want to practice on and i'm gonna go in with the concealer and clean up my eyebrows 
And I like to put a little dab on my hand. I go in with a flat brush like this to clean up my eyebrows. I think I need a flat, a little more of a flatter brush. So I'm gonna just go in with this one and continue to clean up. That one was just too thick for my liking. The thinner, the better. In my opinion. I only two like ones. Hmm. Yeah, it's okay. It's fine. I don't trip about it because I know when to get better. When you practice every day or as much as you can, your makeup will come out better. And if you ever feel like right here, the front of your eyebrow is a little bit too dark, you can always go in with your finger or your whatever finger you want to use, dab it. To make it lighter. And then it makes it lighter. Sometimes I like that, sometimes I don't. It just all depends. And then I'm going to take the rest because I did squeeze out more. Because I needed more for my eyebrows. And I'm just going to go ahead and put it all on my... All on my... Um, eyelid. I'm going to go in with my blender. I'm going to go in with my MAC. I don't know if you can see it. MAC. I don't know if you guys can see it. But it's a, it's a Pro Long Paint Pot. If you guys want to see what it is, I like this. This is really good um, for your, um, for your, if you know, put foundation and put some on top of it. So I'm just going to add some. Go back in with my beauty blender and dab again. Now the fun part, the eyeshadow. I don't think I'm gonna go in depth with the eyeshadow as far as saying what colors I'm using. But if you guys like if I go in depth and saying what colors I'm using, let me know and I'll do it in the next video. Talking while you're doing makeup is kind of hard to do. But you know what? I'm going to practice it as much as I can. By the way, I'm not sure if I said I was going to do like a, a pink look. I don't, know, I don't remember what I said. I say a lot of things. 
But anyway, I think I'm gonna just go with the flow. I do want to do a pink look, um, like practice a pink look, but I'll for sure could do that in the next video. I know the first two videos I did something natural. I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone and do something a little bit more dramatic. If you guys have any ideas, I'm not sure if I said all this already. Just let me know. Or if you just want me to do the makeup, I'll just do it. We do have like a little um, change color thing. Dry maker brush cleanser to switch the colors. Although sometimes I do not use the same brush. But I still like to clean it. Just in case. Mm, just in case I decide to go back with that color. I mean, with that, with that makeup brush. I do like to go in with the blank brush or brush going with the makeup brush that does not have um makeup product in it and I just like to blend that one wasn't really of a good one you should have known that one was more of a pretty one this one this one more more of a fluffy brush I'm gonna go in with the little brush, go back with the same color. And I went back with this with the first color that I did. I'm actually correction. Just going back and putting some of the color back on top. I wonder if I messed it up. Let me see if I can smooth that out. I don't know why I'm whispering. I don't need a whisper. I like that my house is so quiet. My eyes were gonna tear on the side. So I just stopped messing with it. Cause then I know I'm gonna mess it up more. Shh. 
Shake, 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 shake your booty. <laughs> Okay, not the best, but that's okay. Oh, I have an idea. Why am I doing that? I'm done messing with it. Now I'm gonna go with my foundation. Foundation. So I got like to set my uh, foundation after I use my brush. There we go. And then earlier I dropped my bronzer. So. That's next. Oh, actually, no, I'm lying. That is not next at all whatsoever. What's next is mascara. What happened to all my mascaras? I had a bunch of them. Okay, well, I have only this mascara, but it's a... Uh, Moonstruck Lash Primer. I don't know if I should use this. But whatever. Let's just use it. Yeah, let's just use it, right? The only thing is, I don't know if it's going to stay white. Okay, it's fine. No biggie. I don't need it. I'm just going to put lashes on anyway. So I'm going to use these ones. These are, I think it's called Kiss Me Now. I don't remember what it's called because I don't have the box anymore. Time to put these beautiful lashes on.
I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, maybe this could be like a new look. Just kidding. <laughs> but hey, there are no like lashes that have fake eyelashes that have like colored on them anyway. Wow. Maybe this could be a new look then. <laughs> Why not? Let's do some highlight today. There we are. Take another blending brush that has nothing in it. I mean nothing on it I'm gonna take this lip pencil liner and trace it around my lips I love these little Morphe lip lippies. I think they're so cute. There's the look. Um, no, I don't have the setting spray, so I'm gonna pass that up. I actually need to go shopping for some things that I need. So maybe I'll do like a haul or yeah, maybe I'll get, I'll do like a haul for the stuff that I need. And maybe I can do like a haul of the stuff that I get, that I needed. If you guys are interested, please let me know in the comments. Um, thank you for watching my video. Please comment and subscribe. Bye!